welcome to Dexter's Adventure. Welcome back to Dexter's Adventure. As a new YouTuber just like me, I know you have a lot of questions coming out from your mind like how do I request for my PIN? What will I do after not receiving the mail in verifying my account? Or how are you going to do manual verification? All those questions will be answered in this vlog so let's start on how are you going to request for your pin in order for you to get your pin mailed to your address you need to have or to reach the ten dollar threshold on your revenue in your youtube channel so you can check that on your YouTube studio on the revenue part. So after reaching the $10 threshold, the YouTube team will automatically send you your PIN through your mailing address registered in your channel. So this is the mail that they will be sending you so the date is included in the mail so you need to take note the date that they sent the pin in your mailing address the main reason why you need to take note the date that they sent you your pin is for you to know when are you going to ask for another copy just in case you will not be receiving after the month duration yes you heard it right you can request for another copy after three to four weeks of waiting so in order for you to request for another copy you need to do it on your adsense account so in order for you to do that watch this video in your account you just need to click that verify option and see here the recent pin option was grayed out so it means you can request for another pin if not you need to wait until it will be grayed out to be able to request for another copy take note waiting should take three to four weeks after your previous request and now let's click that resend pin and let's just wait for a few days for the letter to arrive at home after asking for another copy you will be receiving this email verification that you were able to request for another copy so in this email it also includes the date that they were able to send you the second copy of your personal identification number. So you need to put in mind that you will be having three chances of receiving or requesting for your personal identification number. You just need to repeat the same process for three consecutive months to request for another copy of your PIN. The time that you were unable to receive your PIN during the three consecutive months of request, that's the time that you will be doing the manual verification. Why there's a need for you to do the manual verification? It is needed in order for YouTube team not to remove your ads in your channel. Because after the fourth month that you were unable to verify your mailing address, they will be removing 
the ads in all your videos. The moment that the YouTube team remove all the ads on your channel, of course, the revenue will automatically stop on your channel and you will not be able to receive your salary on the coming months. So the next question is, how are you going to do manual verification? In order for you to do that, you need to prepare one government issued personal ID. In order for you to do the manual verification, you need to watch this separate video. In the AdSense homepage, this is what you see. Just click on the three dots and you will be seeing the help and send feedback options. And this is what you see after clicking the help option. It's just saying that you will be getting the pin after reaching the $10 threshold and normally it would take two to four weeks to receive the pin. And also you have four months to verify the pin, but it never happened. That's why we are doing the manual verification. To start the manual verification, just click this pin troubleshooter. And on this page, it will ask you if you reach the $10 threshold. So all you need to do is to click that yes option. On the next question, it will be asking you if you receive your PIN, which it never happened. That's why you will be selecting the no option as your answer. Then it will be asked you if you had requested for three times, which is yes. Then it will just give you few reminders that after the fourth month, it will stop showing ads without verifying your account. So you need to click the contact as option. So you need to fill up your name. Then of course, your email address linked to your YouTube account. And lastly, your AdSense publisher ID. Also, don't forget to take a photo of your government issued ID and attach on this part of the page. After filling up all the information needed, you need to click the submit option and you will be having the verification information that it has been sent. So you just need to wait for at least 24 to 48 hours for the team to respond. Okay, so after performing the manual verification, you will be able to get this verification email in less than an hour saying that your mailing address has been verified. And yes, you heard it right. I got my mailing address verified in just one hour. But it's not the same case as you, as it may be taking much time depending on the availability of the YouTube team. So for sure on my next video, I will be showing you my first YouTube revenue in my YouTube channel. Thank you guys for watching my latest video. Please don't forget to click the thumbs up button if you like this kind of video. And please don't forget to leave your comments and suggestions on the comment box below. And lastly, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button to be able to get latest videos directly from me. Thanks guys for watching Dexter's Adventure.